for this lesson, uh, we'll teach you how to use cardboard and from the idea that you have generated uh, to use cardboard to express your idea into a three-dimensional object and of course for your purpose uh, to include the electronics inside to put in the LED, put in the switch and the battery to, to make it into a, a, a finished pro project where you will uh, showcase your creativity right? so this particular lesson will teach you how to use cardboard uh, cut the cardboard and a uh, few of the various uh, safety precautions uh, to equip you the knowledge to how to make the model. A couple of tools that you will need, all right? Uh, first of all is a glue gun. A glue gun is very useful. Glue gun like this, all right? It comes with a refill. Uh, it's 240 volt. Uh, it means you plug it to the wall. Uh, a little thing to note is that you are plugging this to the wall and so therefore uh, make sure that you know what you're doing before you plug it in, right? Uh, the glue gun is hot, all right? This part will be heated up and uh, in order to, to sort of melt the glue. So please make sure that you don't touch the glue that's coming off or any of this part, right? When you're doing your work. Right, next, you would need a pen knife and a steel rule to cut, right? Again, uh, you're cutting with very sharp uh, tool so be careful when you cut uh, your cardboard please make use of the steel rule as a guide and keep your fingers away when from the cutting edge when you cut it's good to get cardboard all right the one that we are using is this type of cardboard uh, which you can find uh, it's single corrugated um, which means that it is like this okay single ply corrugated cardboard okay single ply all right uh, the advantage of this cardboard is that if you were able to find the right side, you can actually tear this, right? Separate them into bits and the other piece of cardboard will be bendy, right? Either you can bend it, okay? Like this, you can be bendy, you can bend it this side to form a cylinder with the smooth outside or you can turn it around and bend it this side, alright? And then you can have the rough a textured surface okay so you can use apply some hot glue or double sided tape and you can uh, trim in the right side at the correct place and then you can form a nice cylinder cutting the cardboard and if you do it properly all right if you sort of score a thin line without cutting all the way through you are able to then bend into a box okay and cutting off and then you can actually use that to um, apply some hot glue here and then you should be able to form up a square box or rectangular box for your design, all right? Uh, if you want, you can tear off one side and it can be textured. Okay, the next few tools that you need is scissors, perhaps a double-sided tape and a smaller pen knife, all right, for you to do small little operations.